I am jealous of my wife's friend. Okay, so I don't want to bury the lady here, so I'll start with the fact that I am a very quiet person. I don't talk much, and it's very difficult to do so, almost surely connected to my being on the autism spectrum. My wife Becca is also on the spectrum, but she's very verbal, and needs a lot of talking to feel seen, understood, and experienced. Until recently we've had an extremely verbal daughter at home, and Becca has had many friends, all of whom have helped fill the conversational gap I leave, and none of whom I've ever been jealous of. Recently our daughter went off to college, and for various reasons Becca lost basically all of the friends she used to talk to, but she made a new friend Nick. She got him hired at her job where they work in the same small office every day. They have lunch together most days. They text in the morning before work, after work, and at night. They go out at least once a week, and it's usually something like this example from a couple of weeks ago. Dinner at an Italian restaurant. Be op. They share a bottle of wine over dinner, and talk for an hour or two. Then go back to his place for a movie. After the movie they go for a walk along the train tracks and discuss it, typically somewhere around five hours total. Another time they drove out to the woods an hour or so away for lunch, hike, and dinner, about eight hours. Nick has started coming with us to movies, concerts, trivia nights at the local pub, and to our house for special events. He comes with us to various outings like flea markets and the Ren Fair and such. After so many fights about it, Becca kicked me out to stay with our daughter in another state for a few days, so we could cool off from the fighting and reflect on our own selves. We lined up well because Nick was going to be away on vacation, so that was not an issue. But Nick came back early and of course they hung out. He was over at our house so late and they got so drunk I had to just send a goodnight text instead of our usual FaceTime. She replied about an hour later, maybe 12.30 or 1 or, saying she hadn't looked at her phone. The thing is when we're together, she always responds to Nick's texts immediately. I actually, truly, don't think they are being romantic or romantic. But I do feel like, well I don't know, if he's taking the place of our daughter and her old friends, do I have any right to be jealous that she wants to talk to him all the time? I feel like a jerk, which she agrees with, crazy and lost. I'm definitely jealous of something, probably that this guy can connect with my wife to an extent that has been super difficult for me and that I have tried for over 20 years. It highlights all my worst deficiencies, the things I already hate myself for. I get even more quiet and withdrawn, I protect myself by trying not to care, I get angry and yell, I try to make her feel bad and back off of the relationship even a little. But she insists she's not doing anything wrong and to compromise it all would be to abandon her principles and admit she's done wrong. At this point, I feel sad, lonely, and guilty all the time. I try to just shut up about the whole thing, but eventually somehow I bring him up and I'm the problem all over again. I don't know if our marriage will survive this, and all over, as Becca puts it. You don't want me to have a friend. You don't want me to have anyone to talk to. 